Hi everybody, it's Miss Nell here and today we are going to be making something fun. We are going to be making some slime. So what we need is corn flour and conditioner. Any conditioner you like, you might have some lying around. Um, yeah, whichever one you like. So let's get started. It's a very messy job, so make sure you've got an apron on or you've rolled up your sleeves. You don't have any jewellery on. Okay, so I'm going to start with about a cup of corn flour. Normally I just add all of everything in, but let's start with a little bit. And then I'm going to just squeeze a bit of the conditioner, probably about half a cup. Ready, ooh. I've chosen a coconut one, so I can give it some nice nice smell okay now here's the fun part you gotta mix it with your hands oh, it's gonna feel so weird but it's nice very soft so basically you just have to mix it together until it inco you incorporate all of the corn flour okay it's gonna be very sticky at first and you'll know it's ready when it doesn't stick too much to your hands when it's more in a solid shape okay so you can see mine is very soft still so i and it doesn't make a shape yet it's more like just normal icing so i need to add some more corn flour let's see if i'm still can do this without messing everywhere okay so i'm going to add about another cup or so okay mix 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 if you want to add any glitter you can if you want to add maybe a color you can do that too just a little bit there's loads of different recipes that you can do to make slime this is just a nice one i like because it's only two ingredients you don't need a lot of things now can you see it's getting a little bit thicker now it's kind of like holding a shape so we're almost there all we got to do is add can you see that it's coming off my hands a little bit easier so we just need a little bit more corn flour so you will probably end up using the whole thing to be honest let's mix 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 and then it should be ready in a minute you'll see it's going to start you'll be able to form a circle and it won't stick can you see it's, there we go look it's coming off the side still very sticky so let's see if i can try and get all the stickiness off okay see look it's looking a lot better a lot better so let's see if i can roll it into a ball there we go guys and this is nice slime as well because it kind of feels a bit like marshmallows so look there okay so that's the consistency we're looking for so i've rolled that now i can get all the gunk off of my hands some of it's still a bit sticky so basically you just add it until you can do that let's see if i can form another shape you don't want it to be runny it kind of needs to be a little bit like play-doh in a bit but not as soft okay you see that it's looking really good really good and it smells so nice so look there look how nice and soft that is so when you're done making your slime you need to make sure you store it in an airtight container look Ooh, that's exactly what we want okay we want it to be stretchy we want it to be wanting to fall out of your hands okay that's perfect so now we're just about done okay that is how you make your slime so i would say look i've only got a little bit of corn flour left so i would say it's about 200 grams of corn flour and half a bottle of conditioner so about 150 mils so if you can see that is what it must look like look it's nice and stretchy and perfect for you to be creative and build or construct anything you like with your slime well i hope you've enjoyed your video 
and I hope you have a easy time making your slime. Let's see, don't forget to send us some pictures of once you're done. I hope you've enjoyed this video. See you later. Bye.